So before the video gets started, just to let you know, I'm going to be doing a giveaway when I reach 10,000 followers on my Instagram, so make sure to follow me now so I can post it soon. Hello everybody, it is Louisa and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a sort of like, I think I'm going to call it like how I'm preparing for my A-levels because if you're new to my channel, basically um, I've just finished year 11, so obviously GCSEs got cancelled. I'm sure you all know about that already, uh, but basically I'm just trying to do a little bit of work every day. Hopefully like prepare myself for year 12 because I just want to give myself like the best preparation so that when I go back in September, I'll be nice and fresh and I won't like... Um, be really far behind because I feel like if I had six months off with like doing no work whatsoever I would just be in a mess. Yeah I hope this video is helpful to you guys that are also in the same year as me maybe don't really know like what to do over the summer holidays. Obviously like we are sort of like coming towards going back to school now however we still got like I don't know how many weeks we'll have when this goes up but we'll still have like what like four weeks left maybe like three and a bit weeks left. That is plenty of time to maybe um like start preparing for your A level like if you literally just spend like half an hour to an hour like every day um, on one subject and hopefully like it will be easier for when you go back to school in September. I'm basically just going to be filming my day and showing you guys like what I'm doing to hopefully prepare myself for next year. In no way shape or form am I saying that you need to do lots of work because I'm definitely not doing a lot of work like I literally haven't done anything for about a week um, but like hopefully this video will motivate me to get back into it because say like in June I was doing about like an hour to like an hour and a half like every day maybe like half an hour on each subject because I'm doing business geography and French A level so I'm doing three subjects so I try and spend like half an hour on each subject every day excluding weekends so hopefully if you're in year 11 and you're watching this video then it might be a sign if you haven't already started doing a little bit of work every day to maybe just spend literally 30 minutes every day maybe like if you're doing a language learning some vocab or say you're doing like geography or RS or I don't know what subject just trying to like go over the GCSE content before you go into A level. I feel like you kind of need the um, like basic GCSE knowledge as a foundation for your A level course. For example in geography I'm trying to learn at the moment the natural hazards topic from the GCSE because I know that that will definitely come up in the A level course. Yeah I don't want to ramble too much uh, because I just want to film my day and yeah I think from now on I'm just going to be doing like a vlog sort of like style video of my day so yeah I hope you guys enjoy the video. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you do and subscribe to my channel if you're new because I've got so many like school related videos coming up soon and make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss out on them videos. So yeah without further ado let's get on with the video. Okay so I'm currently holding my camera between my legs so this is not a flattering angle and I don't know whether to do my makeup or not because I can't really be bothered but then I'm filming a YouTube video so I feel like I have to but we're just gonna embrace this spot. But the time is quarter to 12 in the morning. Who likes my lock screen by the way? Are you ready for this? If you know who that is, you are a queen. But yeah, um, basically, I'm gonna show you guys. So last night, um, if I can pop you on here. Why my under eyes so dark? Oh my God, I look like I've been hit in the eye. Am I okay? Yeah, I'll just put you guys down on my desk. This lighting is really not it, but I mean, I'm, it makes my under eyes look so dark. But in the mirror, they don't even look that dark. But I feel like it might be mascara because I actually got like nine hours sleep last night which is good because the night before I literally had one hour sleep. No, I, I oh my God, they're actually really dark. Surely this, oh yeah, there's a bit of mascara coming off. But I'm just gonna blame it on the lighting, but to be fair, it's probably lack of sleep. But I just wanted to show you guys that last night I basically made a little to-do list. I feel like these little to-do lists make me so much more productive because I can just tick off once I've done something. So see, I've written a few things down. I'll read some of them off. So one hour of business projects because it's been set business project. 40 minutes of geography flashcards, 30 minutes of French break, I have 30, min 30 minutes of French grammar. Okay, that is a lot of schoolwork, I know, but basically I haven't done any for like a week. So like, I feel like I need to catch up on some of the stuff that I started but didn't finish. So I probably won't get it all done, but if it's on a to-do list, then it will motivate me to do more. So always, always write more on your to-do list because the more you write, the more you're gonna do. It doesn't matter if you don't complete it all. And then I've got a couple of videos which I need to film. And then I need to film some TikToks. Make sure to follow me on TikTok if you don't already. 
then I need to do a workout in the evening and then I need to reply to some emails. Yeah, I've got quite a lot written down, but obviously I don't have to do all of it. We'll see how much I get through and this video is to hopefully motivate me to actually do more stuff. I just tick off the thing once I've done it and it just, it just satisfies me when I just get to tick it off. I did start the holidays with like a little like timetable, but I just didn't stick to it at all and I just find it so much easier to write a list and then just tick it off and just make my own order rather than following a timetable. I'm definitely going to start off with some sort of work because filming TikToks isn't as important so right I'm actually going to start with the bottom one which is go through Glacier flashcards. I've got a few uh, packs of flashcards which I'm currently trying to go through at the moment so they'll be in here somewhere. Here they are. Uh, so these are my uh, flashcards all from GCSE by the way. This is my pack of Glacier flashcards. I'm going to put you guys back. So I've actually already like pretty much learned all these. However, I did it I did it like a couple of weeks ago now. So like I might have forgotten like all of them. So I'm just going to go through them again and see how many I can remember. Flashcards, if you didn't know, is my favourite way of revising because you can just like constantly test yourself. Um, I usually just like read mine out loud, which helps me. See, I'm not going to film myself going through them because I literally just like look like a weirdo because I just be like shouting out all the answers so yeah but I've got like a little pack here to go through I'll come back soon when I've finished going through them okay so here's my list I need to take off oh it's the bottom one go through glacier flashcards if my hand's shaky it's because I'm left-handed and I'm using my right hand to hold the camera okay so that is one off the list which makes me very happy um however I think it's like about lunch time now okay it's like 20 past 12 basically so yeah it's a bit early for lunch but then i don't know if i want to do more work i suppose i could do half an hour or something maybe by the way that's my tripod yeah okay what should we do i don't really want to go through flashcards again because that's kind of draining mm. i think i'm going to do half an hour of my business project so yeah i'm going to get my laptop out and um, i'm going to do some business projects so i'm going to turn on my laptop ready for this noise yes we love that it's probably not going to be interesting for you guys, so I'm just going to log on to my computer. Okay, I'm just going to sign into my MacBook account. Let me know how you guys are doing, or what you've been up to. Um, I hope you guys are all keeping safe. Oh, what's that hair? You know when you get hair like in your in your eyelash? Is it just me, or does that always happen? I'm just going to let you guys know that I'm not going on a hol holiday anymore. I did put on my Instagram story that I may be going on holiday. Um, like there was quite a high chance of me going, but we decided not to go um, just for like like safety reasons really. It's obviously not very safe at the moment to go on a plane and you know what I mean? So yeah, we're not going, but hopefully when we can go on holiday and it's safe, then it'll be really good and I can vlog it because I was so excited to do a holiday vlog and pack with me and stuff like that. But you know, what can we do about it? Okay, so I've just got up my... Um, um, word document i don't really want to show it all because um i don't want people in my class to copy me not that they would but like you know what i mean uh sorry guys if you thought you'd go copy me i'm joking basically we got set some like little projects and like transition sort of tasks for next year so i just want to get them done because i kind of been putting them off and sort of been doing my own thing not really following the tasks that we've been set we got set two business projects the first one was to make a powerpoint and we got to present it on the first day back which is like the worst thing because i just hate powerpoints like i hate presenting I know like I do YouTube and stuff, but that's just so different. Like when I do YouTube, I feel like I'm talking to myself. Whereas like actually like having an audience, I just don't like. So yeah, I finished that, which is good, but I've got another project to do. And we've got to write about a business basically and like analyze it. And, yeah, that's fun. Uh, I chose Ikea. So yeah, it's going all right. I've still got a lot left to write and I've done 700 words. <laughs> had my lunch and i didn't film it because it doesn't really relate to the video but yeah i'm just not really in the mood today like you know he's feeling a bit like uh, like a bit groggy and like i keep going on tiktok that is the problem like every time i'm on my phone i just go straight to tiktok and it's really bad and i'm just not really feeling it today i'm not in the mood so can we just talk about how long my hair is i didn't even realize it was this long like it's literally down to like bottom of my stomach this video is already such a mess like i'm really sorry i'm gonna pick something from my list so i think i'm gonna do some french because i haven't done french for a very long time okay so basically i've got this little revision guide which i used uh, last year for gc let me get this out of my face 
I used it last year for revising for like mocks and stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna write out this paragraph about reflexive verbs onto a flashcard, I think. Page 79 of the textbook, if you are interested. <laughs> So I've just finished writing my flashcard. I spent a bit of time reading through some pages in my book for French. So I'm going to take the um, French grammar off the list. And I think now I'm just going to quickly reply to some emails. Okay, so I just finished replying to my emails. So that is done. And I think I'm now going to have like a little break. Um, so I just got back from my walk and I've just placed you on my tripod. Uh, just because I want to like talk a little bit so basically to be honest i'm not really feeling like doing work today i know this video is about preparing for a levels but like i don't want you guys to see this video and think oh like she's doing loads of work like i should be doing loads of work because honestly like i haven't been doing a lot of work I'm trying to do like an hour and a bit every day excluding weekends but yeah i've had so many like days off from it just because i just haven't been in the mindset and if you're not in the mood to do work and you just want a break then that is okay because i think a break is better than forcing yourself to do work because it's just not going to go in if you're not in the mood to do it so yeah i'm really just not in the mood this afternoon to do it really and um, i might do like half an hour later but yeah i just wanted to let you guys know that just because i'm doing this video does not mean that you have to do loads of work and that you're wrong if you're not doing work because um i think this break is really good just to have a rest but yeah i'm actually going to go downstairs now and watch some netflix and chill out eat because that is what you need to do to make yourself feel good and have a break from stress so yeah i'm gonna chill out for a bit and then i'll come back if i decide to do more work but i think i'm going out for tea tonight so i don't really know because i need to get ready for that hey guys so it's now about 5 p.m 5 15 p.m in the evening i was just watching some netflix and some youtube videos just really like having a chill day i'm sorry that this video probably hasn't been very motivating to do work because obviously like i haven't actually done that much but i just don't really want to like overload myself with work when i just would rather be like spending the time relaxing and having a break but if you have a look at my list i haven't like completed that many things um I, how many have i done one two three four so yeah i'm sorry about the video being a bit messy and not that great but i just kind of wanted to do like a chatty vlog like style video just so that i can like, update you guys on how like my like quarantine's going and like a levels and stuff like that and um, so yeah make sure to give the video a big thumbs up if you enjoy it and subscribe to my channel if you're new because i'm going to be uploading my gcse results video in like i don't know how long but it won't be that long when this goes up so yeah i'm kind of a bit nervous now i'm not nervous but i don't know but yeah i hope you guys have a nice day and um i'll see you guys all next week for a new video bye